Hey curvy girls all over the world, it's your girl Elisa from Stylish Curves and in today's video I am going to be sharing with you 7 realistic plus size outfits that I would wear in the week. We're going to be doing this Vogue style so if you are interested in today's video you already know what to do and that is to keep on watching. <music> So as an influencer, I get invited to a ton of events, sometimes at nighttime events, sometimes at daytime events. But whenever I'm invited to an event that I need to be there for more than an hour, I'm almost always going to go with a dress. And I am currently obsessed with this dress from a UK based brand called Never Fully Dressed. They make some amazing pieces. And what I also love about this brand is that their pieces are very unique. So with this dress, I love the print. I'm a leopard print girl all the way. And what makes this dress just a little bit more special is that you get this orange contrast detail on the side. Now with something like this, I'm definitely going to pick up the orange. I, I can't not do it, right? So I have some really super cute shoes to show you guys. So I have these orange patent leather platforms that I got from Aldo. Now these are very reminiscent of Valentino platform shoes, but these are probably way more comfortable. <laughs> so they have a nice little cushion on the inside and I'm a heels girl. I love my heels sky high and platforms are actually more comfortable to walk in than stiletto heels. I love how this dress looks with the orange shoes. The platforms really just add that little extra oomph to the outfit. For accessories, I'm wearing these oversized gold hoop earrings. These are from Amazon. If you are looking for inexpensive costume jewelry, definitely check out Amazon. I have on my gold Kate Spade watch. And then I also have on this rose gold bracelet, which I got from Lane Bryant, who also makes really nice jewelry, especially for plus size people. You know, you got thicker wrists, thicker arms, thicker necks. <laughs> Lane Bryant has some really great jewelry. This is a dress that people would definitely want to know. Girl, where you got that dress from? <laughs> this is definitely a statement making look. So this is my lounge around the house outfit. This is a lounge set that I got from a brand called Red Dolls. And what I love about this lounge set is how cozy it is. It's a really chic lounge set. Whenever I wear this in the house now, I don't look this put together in the house all the time. But those days when I'm like, you know, I'm working from home because I am a blogger, an influencer, social media content creator, whatever you want to call us today, I juggle it all. So I work from home. So sometimes I want to add a little extra oomph to my in the house outfits. Lounge sets really boost up my confidence. It even boosts my productivity. Working from home, I feel like it's so easy to just kind of get out of bed, do work in your pajamas. And I used to do that and it's just like, I would wind up back in the bed <laughs> on the couch. So when I started realizing I wasn't being productive, I was just like, we gotta do something. And I'm definitely the type of person, when I look good, I feel good and I do good. And this lounge set is definitely something that makes me look and feel good. I'm like, I'm ready to work. <laughs> and these are also good too, in case I wanna, you know, get on my Instagram stories or if I ever wanna go live. This is also good too for Zoom meetings because I'm already looking put together. Um, being in the house, I definitely wouldn't have on shoes. <laughs> I would probably have on some slippers or some socks or something. And I just love that this set, I feel like it looks good enough to wear outside. So the only accessory I would probably wear around the house is my handy dandy prescription glasses. Yes, y'all, your girl wears glasses. <laughs> so I would throw this on, sit at my desk, get to type in, checking emails, writing a blog post, you know, editing a video. And this is how I would pretty much look for the day. next 
look is what I would call my mommy and son look. I am a boy mom. Shout out to all the boy moms. My little love love, he's not little anymore. Homeboy is 14 years old. So one of the things that I love that we actually kind of bond over is fashion. And he's definitely a sneaker head. Whenever I'm with him, when we go out, we love to go to the movies. That's our thing. So whenever I'm hanging out with my son, I definitely like to stay dressed down because I feel like I'm more comfortable. I can keep up with him. And then I also kind of low key, I like looking like the mom. <laughs> that's the cool mom, the fly mom. So we recently went out to the movies. We went to actually see the air movie and we thought it was really good. So for that movie day, this is something that I really wore. So I threw on the Jordan 11s. These are the cherries that came out last year. And I'm also wearing this really cool oversized sweater that I got from Farm Rio. I saw them with my Louis Vuitton Louisa earrings. And then I also wore my um, red Movado watch. It has a leather band and also a gold dial. And then for a bag, I would definitely rock this Gucci Soho London bag. I love this bag. This is actually the first designer bag that I bought with my blogger money. This is when I went full time as a blogger over 10 years ago. Can you guys believe that? Oh, I didn't even talk about my jeans. So my jeans are from Good American. These are the Good Leg Denim. I don't know what Good American puts in their jeans, but these are literally some of the best fitting jeans I found. And plus, being that the sleeves are puffy on this, I would just pull them up a little bit to make them look a little bit more voluminous. And this is definitely a Mommy and Me Day outfit. Uh, I think it's really cute and comfortable. And A date night look me and my gentleman caller we would definitely go out get drinks get a good meal what I like about this outfit is that I feel like it is kind of edgy so really good in it so I got this corset from Amazon it is one of my favorite Amazon buys of all time the zipper is functional and I love how it just cinches me in the waist and I'm just you know, I'm just serving, serving the little boobies. <laughs> and I'm wearing a pair of, um, I think they're black or maybe gray, dark gray wash jeans. And these are from Good American. For earrings, I do have on these uh, drop earrings in silver. They're super cute and I feel like it just further dresses up the look for shoes. So I would throw on these metallic silver shoes that I got from Los Lorando. I love their shoes and if you're a girl with big feet like me, size 11, 12, these are some really good shoes and they make some really cute options. So I would slip these on. Now for a bag, I would want to add a pop of color. And I love this Brandon Blackwood bag. It's like a turquoise color and suede. It's so stinking cute. I can also do this silver jewel encrusted bag, which I also got from Amazon. And it is such a really pretty bag. So then I would throw on a trench coat like this. This to me is me. It's a little bit of everything. Like I love to look sophisticated, but I like a little edginess and I like a little sexiness. So I love this outfit for date night. Deciding on a purse is always the hardest thing to do because I really like this pop of color, right? But I'm also thinking the silver. Let's do the pop of color with the branded Blackwood. So yes, I feel good in this. I feel confident. I feel proud. And this is definitely a look my man, my gentleman caller would be proud to see his lady in. <laughs> I'm wearing one of my favorite cardigans, which is from Hanifa Baby. So this is what I would wear if I were going to the coffee shop to do some work or to maybe check some emails, listen to a podcast. Working from home, I'm always wanting to get out of the house. <laughs> so this is something I would wear to do just that. Something cozy and comfortable. I'm actually wearing a pair of Old Navy jeans. This is their Rockstar jeans for earrings. I love these earrings right here that I got from 
Amazon. These are so cute. And for a bag, I would definitely do one of my favorite bags, which is the Givenchy Soft Antigona. I feel like this bag was slept on, but it's so cute. It's definitely one of those bags that can carry everything you need for the day. And if I wanted to wear heels, I could just throw on a pair of heels, which I actually have right here. And it will go with this bag. So I got these mules from um, Kate Robin. It's an affordable shoe brand on Amazon. And then for shades, because I always have shades for the sunny days. So I would throw on my Fendi shades. And I love these shades because it does have the Fendi logo all over it, but you really can't see it. But this right here is a really cute casual vibe for me. It's very realistic, and it's an easy throw on outfit. I look polished and put together. And this is what I would wear shopping. So this is my running errands shopping day outfit. This two-piece jargon set, I've had this for a while. I love it, it is so comfortable. I got this jargon set from Amazon Essentials. For the spring, I would definitely style this with one of my favorite, favorite jackets to have, and that is a trench coat. I have this really nice and chic khaki-colored trench coat that I got from H&M. I love throwing this on with jogger sets. So I love mixing something that looks a little bit classic with something that looks a bit street style. And I also threw on another pair of Jordan 11s. So these are the Animal Instincts. I love these. These are definitely one of my favorite pair of sneakers. So I'm gonna be comfortable when I shop. I, I don't want my feet hurting. Back in the day, back when I was in my early 20s, your girl definitely used to shop with heels on. I said I would never do that again because I think my feet are still upset with me to this day. <laughs> I have to break out one of my favorite pairs of earrings and it is these twist handmade earrings from an Etsy designer. Her brand is called It's All Culture. Every time I wear these earrings, you guys, I get tons of compliments on them. I would also throw on a pair of shades with this. I would probably do some black shades. And then, because I'm shopping and I'm a crossbody girl, I'm definitely gonna do a crossbody bag. So I would do my um, YSL Lou bag. I wear this bag all the time. You would think this is the only bag I own. And I would just rock it as a crossbody. And this is my running errands look. So this is a look that I would definitely wear to brunch with the girls. So me and my friends, when we go to brunch, we want to look cute, we want to be comfy, and we definitely don't want to be too dressed up unless it's like a truly special event at brunch. But when it's just us, because we're going to kiki and laugh, we're probably going to go shopping after. We might even catch a movie. We might even hit a rooftop bar. <laughs> so in the springtime, I love blazers like this because they really add a little personality to your outfit. Now this one I got from Shein, but I don't shop Shein often. But when I do, I do find a really good piece like this. I'm also one of those girls who recycles her clothes. So I'm gonna wear my stuff over and over. I'm definitely not one of those people who are like, I need a new outfit every day. So we threw back on those Good American Good Leg Jeans. This blazer has so many different colors in it. I could wear any color shoe with this. And I threw back on these patent leather orange platforms from Aldo. I think it's super cute. Now what I would add to this in typical Alisa fashion, I would definitely do a gold chain link necklace. These are my favorite accessories to buy, the chain link ones. I love when they're chunky like this. I feel like these just add a little extra oomph to your outfit. So I found these round oversized shades on Amazon. They are reminiscent of <laughs> my Chloe Carlina sunglasses that I had for three years, y'all, and I lost them. Oh my gosh, I was so heartbroken. I wanna buy them back again. <laughs> but I found these on Amazon. They look so similar 
that I was like, okay, these are cute. I could live with this. <laughs> and this is just an outfit that I would definitely go to brunch and hang out with the girls and just have a good time. I felt cute in it. It's comfortable. And I feel like it's one of those statement blazers that someone's going to be like, where did you get that blazer from? This is definitely a chic brunch look for me so those are my seven realistic plus size outfits that i would wear throughout the week i tried to give you guys a little bit of everything from what i would wear when i'm on mommy duty what i would wear to a blogger or an influencer event date night and things like that if you want to see more videos like this let me know in the comment section below also hit that thumbs up button so youtube can know that you guys liked it and that they will push my videos through even more i was so inspired by the vogue youtube channel to do this because i used to love when they did the seven days seven outfits with celebrities and just seeing how celebrities really dress themselves when they're not on the red carpet so if you guys want to keep up with me you want to know what i'm up to and other things that i wear throughout the week make sure you're following me on instagram under at stylish curves for more plus size fashion style and beauty make sure you guys visit the blog stylishcurves.com please hit that subscribe button down below along with the notification bell so you can be notified every time i upload a new video also, if you want to check out more spring fashion, you guys should definitely check out these two videos right here. Thank you so much for your support and for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!